You can't get LASIK. You've been told several times, and you've heard about this ICL. Is that really something that'll help out? Is it a good option? Well, the ICL, or the implantable contact lens, most commonly known by, is actually a great option to help correct vision. Uh, it's actually brought the ability for a number of people that used to not be able to have LASIK, be able to have a refractive surgery to help them see better. You know, wh what, is it? what is ICL? Well, instead of a contact lens going on the eye, they put a contact lens inside the eye. Now, you say, well, how old is this surgery? Well, the surgery itself is, you know, about 10 years old, but it follows the same principles behind cataract surgery. So when they go in, they'll go into your eye, and they'll slip the lens behind the iris, but in front of the lens. It seems like it shouldn't be there. That sounds really weird, putting a lens inside the eye. Well, the one wonderful thing about ICL is we can actually reverse it. We can go take the lens out if we need to. LASIK, we can't undo what we've done. So not only does it allow some people to get a refractive surgery, and not only is it a, a very good surgery that has a lot of, you know, the surgical techniques are very similar to things that, you know, we do all the time, but also it gives a much better quality of vision. You see, when you get LASIK, LASIK is wonderful. I had LASIK and it provides great vision. When you have some people that have significant prescriptions where they're extremely high, we need to figure out, well, is it safe for us to remove that much tissue and still keep a stable eye? Sometimes it's not. Even when it is, we start to think that the ICL may still be a better option because when we're removing a lot of the eye or a lot of tissue, and even though we're using a wavefront laser and we're using an interlace, you're still going to have more aberrations, more glare, more halos with LASIK. Now when we come in and we slip the lens inside the eye, the quality of vision is you know, seemingly HD, much more high definition, clearer than what LASIK can sometimes offer. It's been wonderful. As the FDA works with the doctors, uh, it, there actually may be even more potential and opportunities to help correct for astigmatism, farsightedness, nearsightedness, and even, even presbyopia, or the ability for you to be able to read up close. So there, there are some good options with the implantable contact lenses. Don't shy away. It's a little bit more expensive than LASIK, but the ability to be able to have the surgery, have the higher quality of surgery, and if anything were to be wrong or problematic with it, we can always remove the lens and go back to glasses and contacts. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to learn more about you know, the different surgical techniques or things you can do to help take care of your eyes, you know, like us on Facebook, like us on Google+, and subscribe to us on YouTube to learn more and keep up to date with your eyes.